Hello, welcome to Anson Griffin's Occasion Series of MATLAB Tutorials. Today we're looking at an assignment set uh, by Harvard EDU and we're looking at computer vision and singular value decomposition. So we assume we'll know a little bit about linear algebra and single value decomposition. We're not starting from absolute scratch. So uh, I've given the credit there and I'm just going to let you read the comments yourself. The solution is available online if you want to look it up yourself. So uh, we clear the screen, we close all etc. Uh, we read in uh, SVD, that's just a little screen grab of different notes and we look at the dots file. So, so there's SVD, so we want to solve this homogeneous and the homogeneous is instead of having xy we get xy1 and we want to solve for a b and c uh, equal to zero there's the image so this is we have three planes we have the red plane the green plane and the blue plane and we're trying to do a line fit a line to each and we're trying to do it in a homogeneous set of equations so just go back a little bit in case I skipped anything so I've read in there, I've read in the file and then I found the red indexes, the green indexes and the blue indexes and we're assuming that the red is in plane 1, the green is in plane 2 and the blue is in plane 3 so in this line here we're saying um, find um, everything where plane 2 equals 0 and plane 3 equals 0 and that will give me the red coordinates where planes 1 and 3 equal 0 is the green and where planes 1 and 2 equal 0 that gives me the blue Okay, we want to get them into a homogeneous form so we're going to do that in a second down here so we have for instance here um, I've skipped a line or two but it's the same thing but just two for one we have x green y green and then we've added on the third column of ones and then we get the equation with the green line use the single value decomposition SVD a green so I I assume you know what singular value decomposition is you'll get three matrices U D and V transpose where I'm highlighting here but the only one we're interested in is, is the the third uh, orthogonal matrix V green there so I've explained how to do it for green that will be the same for the red and the blue then what we do here is we on the lines that are highlighted there we work out the equations, the homogeneous equations for the red, the green and the blue and then we plot that on top of the coordinates by using the plot command here and as per usual uh, we have to put hold on so hold on means uh, we keep the image uh, shall we say in focus it doesn't move so we can keep plotting over and over on the same image so there's the lines okay and uh, so there's the blue line there's the green line and there's the red line okay now we want to find where these three intersect so what we've done there is we've stacked these three together like so we've transposed them just as you know the, the little comma there means transpose I shouldn't say comma as a single apostrophe is transposed them and then we solve for the intersection again using singular value decomposition and we get the point then of that so that'll just be a black dot we go down a little bit here and we plot there and there the plot then is the intersection of the tree okay hope that helps a little bit thanks very much bye bye